text message? Run. Yeah. I mean, and honestly, that just gets really boring. Like, aggroing those guys, running away, and like trying to split them up. Like, doing it once would be fine, but it's right before a boss, so you're gonna have to keep doing that. I don't know. Like, that's. It just really gets just tedious after a while. You probably could, it'd probably be easier just to run past them, I guess, but they're so fast. Like, I'd rather just run to the boss. They didn't re oh, fuck's sake, get out of here. Um, we didn't really explore this area, so let's do that before we start messing around with the boss. Um, because I know that looped around. We did find that out. And again, I'm, you know, I'm bitching a lot, but one, that's just shit's gonna happen. You get frustrated. But two, and I'm going I'm giving everything a chance, right? Like I'm I want to give the game Wait, hold on. Sorry I got confused here. I'm trying to get my bearings. All right. So we came up to the right side. So first let's check this side. I don't I don't know if we went this way or not. But uh I mean I'm definitely going to give everything a chance, right? Because I'm used to playing it like Dark Souls, but it's not Dark Souls. It's Bloodborne, different game. So I have to readjust Okay. And sorry if, if, you know, again, my memory's terrible, so I'm sh I don't doubt that I've probably been over here at least a little bit. Because I know some of this area we did get a chance to explore when I finally lost those stupid werewolves. Yeah, because that's, yeah, I remember this, this overlook. Uh, overlooking the area that we mostly just skipped. Ah, uh, right, right, right. And then there was this, which I don't even think I went down here all the way. Where's that ladder? I kind of would rather go this way. This way I can see what I'm dropping down on. Oh, and you also equip the torch so I can actually see what the hell's going on. And luckily, they're on that Dark Souls 2 thing where where your time is limited on it. Uh, at least as far as I can tell, I don't think there's a timer on it. It was in uh, in Dark Souls 2. It was in like your your inventory or something. Your inventory screen? It's not even listed? A uh, War Messenger Top Hat. I went ahead and claimed that. That was just from uh, from my pre-order. Uh, I also got the bells to summon people and to join other summon worlds. I don't. I definitely do not want to summon anyone. Uh, I feel like that just takes away a lot from the achievement aspect, you know? Like the satisfaction, personally. AI in this game is... Walkie. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Camera, please target him. What the hell? Looks like some kind of like. Man, this guy's got some hit points too. Look like some kind of weird. And I know this is going to sound ridiculous, but some kind of weird like werewolf human hybrid, which I understand the whole. I realize what werewolves are. But I think, hopefully, like, at least, is it like somebody who's halfway werewolfed? Half wolf transformation, whatever. Anyway, let's continue. All right, there's nobody over there. There's the ladder. Things get awful. We want to fight this guy over here. Because I see there's a patroller over there. See him. Trying to use my combos. I did a three hit whip slash because I knew he'd be staggered. And then as I was getting near the end of my um, end of my uh, stamina, I did the little quick stab with the thing to kind of one get extra damage, obviously, but two also uh, like push him away a little bit more. All right. So yeah, this is definitely new. I definitely have we we remember going down here and being like noping the hell out of here. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm one thing I do like about this game for sure is that uh, I like these the weapon or the not weapon, like the the weapon like the what am I trying to say the the combat definitely seems more nuanced. See, you can get some good damage in there because he would be staggered the whole time. Wow. Just 
see if I can get some more health back. Whoa, what was that? Did you hear a gonk? I don't know what that was. Anyway. Or was that just me? I thought it like hurt. Maybe that was me hitting the wall or something? I don't know. Anyway, let's use some health. Especially being in a new area, I want to be careful. Firearm is effective. Okay. But yeah, and, and from what I can tell, and again, I... As far as spoilers go, I definitely trying to avoid major spoilers. Even some things like how to play the game properly, I enjoy figuring out myself. But there are other things that I... I won't say I would have never figured out, but might not have figured out for a long time. For example, that whole backstep attack. That backstep thing definitely, in my opinion, should be in the tutorial. Like, because look at this. Look at this. It's fast and it's got a really good range, and it's perfect for the the whole thing it's used for, which is to get out of the way, but then of course since you've backstepped, you're further away from the enemy now. But it gets you back in there quickly and really uses that range of the whip. How did you die? I don't know. <laughs> we'll never know. I don't get that. Sometimes when I say view specter, it doesn't work. But uh, yeah, I mean, and somebody also mentioned there's two different types of these messengers, right? There's the ones that leave notes like this, firearms effective, but then there are the ones that uh, that are like, um, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go over here and clear this first. But th then there's the ones where when you die, you leave leave them, and then you click them, and you can see how that person died, just like the the blood stains in the uh, in um, Dark Souls. I'm torn here if I should... You know what? Let's do this. Maybe I can hit more than one. Not quite. But at least I lower their numbers a bit. <laughs> I can... I can... Uh, I'll pull them up here, throw rocks at them, and they'll climb the ladder after me. Alright, there's still two over there. By the way, again, I do tend to try to play cautiously. Oh, wait, there's like a ledge or something over here, isn't there? Oh, no. It's a ledge, but it's sloped. See, it's... Alright, let's climb down the ladder. Quickly. Alright, see, that's the works, please. Target. No, there's another rat! Easy. Swip. Switch back. Thank you. One thing I've got to get uh, out of the habit of... Oh, Jesus. One thing I've got to get in the habit of is when I do that combo, like the uh, light attack, normal light attack is R1. L1, uh, L1 is morph your weapon. Or do a combo. Like that. So one thing I've got to get in a habit of is a lot of times my brain, because it's a piece of shit, um... Well, think. Oh, okay. So I hit. I hit R1, R1 with the whip. L1 to switch to the cane to do the stab attack. Oh, I want to do another quick stab attack. L1 again. Well, what that does, of course, is switch your weapon right back. To uh, or, or it makes you do your more follow up. So if I do, so see how long that takes. So you can't be doing that. All right. I want to. This looks like a trap. I want to view this right there. Oh, you know what? I bet what's happening sometimes with those specters is that um, they're recovering. They're recovering their um, their essences or whatever. Nothing but the dead here. Treasure waits ahead. What is it? Dead or treasure? Come on. Whoa! Damn it! I was trying to look at that. Jack off. All right. All right. Ooh, damn! I need more health. Whoa! Please. I'm definitely gonna need you to dodge when I press dodge. Alright, we got a decent amount of our health back. We need to switch our weapon around. I had my weapon. Oh, that was my fuck up. Yeah, I screwed that up. 
I mean, it's gonna take us a while to get used to some of this. Ah, shit. That healed more than I thought it was. Um, but yeah, it definitely gonna take us a while to learn the combat, but that's fine. If I'd already mastered the combat already, then that would not be that interesting, would it? But uh, I definitely feel like I'm getting a better handle on it. And I like that it's more... I like that it's more in-depth. Beware of item. Okay. Hunter hat. Ooh, nice. That is a scary item. He's got a good point. I'm terrified of that item. We're going to check that stuff out here in just a second. See, I don't mind this little uh, sidetrack. Is there a ladder? I thought I saw a ladder over here. Sorry, I'm being very careful. I do not want to fall down there. Especially if there's no ladder. And it does not appear that there is. Alright, well. I'm trying to see if this place looks familiar. From like a different angle. It does not. Oh, there's a bunch of dead bodies down there. I see what he's talking about. But, um, but yeah, I like that it's more nuanced. Like the backstep attack. Um, and Dark Souls had stuff like that, I think. Like uh, in this game, too, there's also like a rolling attack. Or, that's not it. Work. A rolling attack. Roll in R1. Does a little bit of a different attack. That's with the cane. Oops, I just got to switch. See, it does a little bit of... Mm. And I, like I say, I am finding that sometimes I actually do want to roll instead of uh, do the regular attack. I love that. Att that's my obviously. Th oh, don't I not? Oh, I was meant to look at that armor. That is what. That's my favorite combo so far. Uh, R one a few times, and then that last little stab to push them away and get a little bit more damage. I really like that. I uh, really like that combo. Um, let's look at our items, shall we? I hope the guys are still enjoying. I know we're early on, I know I'm going slow, but if you've watched my Dark Souls, you know this is how I roll, typically. Hunter hats. One of the standard articles of hunter attire fashioned at the workshop. A fine piece of hunter attire that provides stable defense to anyone facing Yarum's beastly threat. Recognizable by its withered feathers, this cap is fashioned after one of the old hunters. Uh, let's see, I'm going to see if any of these others are different. Uh, fashion at the workshop a company with a short cape to wipe away blood. A fine piece of hunter, blah blah blah. Anyone? Uh, allows one to stalk beasts unnoticed by cover of night. Hmm. I wonder if that's like flavor text or is that actually use an item like buff. One of the standard articles of hunter attire. Fine piece of hunter, blah blah blah. Allows one to stalk beasts unnoticed. That's all the same. Oh, that's the black hood stuff. Uh, so here's one thing I've noticed. Uh, or maybe haven't noticed, as the case might be. There's no weight. Um, there's well, first off, <laughs> you're you can't move over to the left to see what those stats were. I guess you can see over here, like the star is arcane, the little white explosion is blood defense. But I can't move to the left, which, like I say, I guess that makes sense. But there's no weight, right? There's no weight anywhere. So I'm guessing in like uh, weight isn't a thing. Like I haven't heard any mention of it whatsoever. So I guess you just want what's the best stats for you, which is pretty cool. Um, one thing I don't like, how do we... So there's three different things we can look at here. That doesn't help. See, I wish it would, it doesn't like tell me if it's better than what I've got or not, right? Like there's no direct comparison. Controls return display. That just is this. Toggle stats is just that. Yeah, it doesn't tell me. Like, there's no straight comparison. So, if I want to see if it's better, I have to go down here. Okay, this is 20 versus 50. Use. Wait, what? Why can I not wear that? I still don't know. What, what's Frenzy, by the way? Resistant to the lure of Frenzy. Oh, okay. Well, that tells me a lot. Oh, I probably have to go to... Um, ah, here we go. Here we go. Maybe it'll show me here. Ah, okay. Here we go. All right. So if it's blue, it's better. If it's red, it's worse. But we're definitely going to wear that. Definitely wear that. <laughs> Let's see. Bandages or actual gloves? I think I'll go with the gloves. Though the bandages might be more intimidating. How are we looking? Ooh. 
Looking, uh, looking pretty badass. Looking like we're ready to kill some, uh, minions of the damned. By the way, I'm glad we've already found the, uh, the sewers. Thank Christ. Let's use this pebble. And pebbles are super cheap, too. They're like 20 souls or something. Motherfucking getting hung on at things. But, um, yeah, those guys have a really big delay when they attack. I don't want to use my bullets on these guys, though. Is the thing. Also, one other thing that I found. I'm going to try this, and I'm probably going to fuck it up really bad. So, prepare yourselves. So, if I use my blood to make a bullet... I can heal if I, obviously, quickly attack enemies. That's pretty cool. Um, that is pretty damn cool. I like that. I like I like little things like that. Like, okay, now you can you can make the decision. Do you want to try that? Do you want to risk, you know, taking a little damage and uh, giving yourself some more bullets and then hoping you get all or most of your life back in that time frame? I like that. I love shit like that. It's not just a oh you use your blood and you're just boned. Like that whole thing about getting your life back doesn't apply because you're you're getting uh you're getting bullets. I'm glad it's not like that. All right, so it looks like this whole area is done. However, there's this I had not forgotten. I had not forgotten. So I can definitely understand why you would think I would have. But yeah, that's why I wanted to clear the bottom first. There is a jump in the game too. I don't know if I actually talked about that, but I did find there is a jump in the game. Unfortunately, thick cold blood. Oh, you know, I wonder if that's um for upgrades. Cold blood. It, nope. Ah, I used to gain a large amount of blood echoes. Nice. So, those I tend to not... Ooh, is there anything over here? Ah, no. Is there? Maybe I can pull on that? No. Can I pull on that? Oh, I took some damage from that fall. But, uh, oh man. I really want to jump down here and see what's over here. Because there's a ladder to another area over there. Tell you what, man, this game... Do we not have anything that's the equivalent of uh, Homeward Bones? Maybe not yet. Right, going. Cooperation. Of the jolliest kind. Alright, tell you what. Um, I'm going to go back and level up. Because I don't want to waste these souls. I did warn you, I, didn't, I tend to play very cautiously. But there's really no point in making you guys watch that. So I will go and level up and fight my way back here. And um, I'll, uh, I'll see you once I get back. All right, folks, uh, a few quick things here. One, I went ahead and just put one more point into skill, uh, but I've almost got enough to level again. So I was gonna use uh, at least some of our little blood echoes here uh, or thick cold bloods. I'm gonna use one and see how much it gives us. Wow, 1500, not bad. Uh, I wanna, I feel like Welcome what's getting us killed here, other than lack of hit points of all, uh, is our damage. Our damage feels really crappy, so that's why I really wanna get our, our start getting our damage uh, up. Uh, it's obviously not helping a whole lot, as you can see here. Hold on one second. If you look at where I'm trying to almost point it with my finger, where it says right hand weapon one attack, it's only gonna bring it to 95, but you know, every little bit is gonna help, especially against bosses. Uh, I don't know if the bullet thing works. I'm going to assume it does, because otherwise it's going to be a real bear. Uh, but anyway, that's what I wanted to show you, is just, you know, leveling that up. Um, I might do another one. How many of those do I have? Farewell. I like her. She's a little bit creepy, but I like her. But anyway, we have how many of these? Oh, do we use them all? Oh, shit, I didn't mean to use them all. Oh, well. I should have been paying attention, huh? Oh well, that's okay. No big deal, just gonna be careful not to throw them. I wanna see what this throwing knife is real quick. I throw a knife with fine serrated blade, one of the old Hunter Henrik's favorite weapons. Do not does not cause a great deal of damage to beasts, but with deft use can distract attackers and keep them at bay. Huh, interesting. Anyway, so the other thing I'm gonna ask uh, is in comments, let me know generally there's two schools of thoughts on clearing stuff, going back and clearing crap. Uh, one, some people want to see everything, right? They want to see all the clearing. They want to see all that stuff. They don't want anything cut out. 
But some folks are like, no, you know what? We've seen you clear this area. You know, it's, you know, don't want to just watch it all over again. Uh, just skip to where you were. So in the comments, let me know what your opinion is, because I'm going to have to clear all the way back to that area I was in, including like the werewolves uh, and all that crap. The werewolves being the worst part. But, um, but yeah, let me know in the comments, like what you want to see. Um, I'll probably end up cutting most of it out. Um, I, I might even like record and then if something interesting happens, put it in. But anyway, just let me know what you're thinking. For the time being, I'm going to skip it. Uh, but definitely in the comments let me know uh, which of those you prefer.